How you golfing the beaver? This is hole number seven, par four, 365. This hole has got my number, folks. I don't know what it is. Nothing really hard. Got a tree on the left. Got a tight entrance going into the green. Maybe that's it. I don't know, but uh, let's see what we can do. Okay, I hope I hope we're on the right hand side of that tree because uh, they got some limbs there that doesn't get trimmed sometimes. Woohoo! How do I know that? <laughs> do you need to ask? All right. Man, I tell you what, I don't know where you're at right now, but it's such a beautiful Sunday. And I hope you're out there playing somewhere if it's like this. These are one of those days you don't want to waste. Let's go. All right, let's see here. Lost a little power there on the old machine. Yeah, I don't know what it is about this hole. You ever have one of those holes where you play that's it? Well, whatever you do, you just you just can't get hold of it. I don't know what it is. All right. Oh, there we are. Okay, All right, we're on the we're on the other side of the tree. That's a good thing. All right, let's see. This is hole. I want to say seven. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Okay, it's in the front. It says it's in the front. That's right. GPS is out. Uh oh. What am I going to do? That's why I'm telling you, folks. We get we get so locked into our tech tectronics, electronics. Excuse me. Looking for a marker? I don't see a marker anywhere. <sighs> All right. I'm going to guess somewhere it's in the, I don't know, 190, 180. Got the wind in front of me. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Extra, if you got wind, you don't, we don't need to hit it hard. We just got to take a little extra club. And right now, I don't know what the yardage is. So I'm taking a nine, nine hybrid. I don't think I can do anything wrong with that. Okay, we're coming out of that grass. It did not, <laughs> it didn't go where I wanted to. Okay, look, we're, we're right of the green and we're going to have to chip up. Well, that's good. Why is that good? Because I've been, folks, 60 degrees. I've been using a lot of 60 degrees lately because, why? Because these greens are so fast. I normally, I normally like to pitch up or chip up with either a pitcher wedge or a nine iron. But these greens are so fast now that they're not, they're not hanging on. So, uh, 660 is what I'm using nowadays and that's what we're going to be using right here. Oh, there it is. Right, right, almost right on the top of it. It's in that thick grass. Okay. All right, now, you see this? Would you use a 60 on that? Usually, well, we always like to use a 60 when it's sitting fluffy up, right? Well, use the, learn to use your 60 around the green. When these greens are fast, you just have to, you just got to do stuff like that. Now it's buried. So 
So you're going to have to come down with a descending blow, but do not give up on it. And stop. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, let me cut, bring y'all up here. It was coming out of that grass, so I guess you might call it what, a little hot? I don't know. Didn't catch all the backspin that you want with a 60, but it, but if I would have came in there with a pitching wedge or something else, that ball would have gone even further. This is not a give me putt for sure. Like I said, it was not a gimme putt. That's a bogey on my hole. I'm telling you, this hole has my number. One of these days, one of these days. All right, let's buy you golf. Let's see if I can find you another one.